Now suppose, so we only did the type 2 move one way actually. So now suppose we reverse the move and go from D2 to D1. And go from D2 to D1. So what's that look like? Type 2 move that decreases crossings, that simplifies it when you go from here to here. So now we have to um, check. I guess, um, again, we have to, uh, we, we can do the same thing. I guess one possibility is uh, they're all the same color. If they're all the same color, then the obvious thing is keep the same color, right? Label these both the same. The other possibility is uh, what? If you see three colors, and if there's three colors, it has to sort of be in a certain way. So I guess the thing to say here is, um, maybe I guess let's just, let's just uh, simplify this a little bit and just say we'll just color and as follows. Decrease the number of crossings. With type three move, it's just like the sliding move, and depending on how you look at it, um, going backwards is just another sliding move. They're sort of the same. Obviously, it changes the picture, but if you're considering the type of move it is, and all the different colorings that we have that we're going to consider, there's only sort of one direction to consider. So um, maybe I'll just say that. Luckily, <coughs> here we need only. Consider uh, the move in one direction. I'll just give a little thing to think about. Question mark Y. So when I put things like Y here, it's not not because I'm wondering. Okay. But, all right. So here are the possibilities. Here are the possibilities. There's a lot of possible, well, not all, some number, I guess uh, five. 
Right, so here are the possibilities for tricoloring uh, B1. So I guess let's, just to remember what the type 3 move here is, let's just put it up here. So there's a little thing here. And then I guess, uh, let's go then. If you have, you know, parents that are sort of like, what are you, what are you up late doing, huh? <laughs> you know, you're like, you're like, come up and they're like, here's some stand. I made you some standards and you're working hard. And they look at what you're doing. They're like, I thought you were studying. You're a bad child. I'm gonna keep my sandwiches, my milk and cookies. Um, all right. So um, I'm gonna stop drawing the. I think often in the future I'll probably stop drawing the dash circle thing. It's, I think we sort of have an idea now what that's about. So let's draw this uh, possibility here. So I guess it could all you could just see one color. So if you just see one color, let's call this M. Let's call this M. M. I guess there's a strand coming in M. 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 And then uh, I guess what's the What's the obvious sort of choice to do here? Yeah, just make it M. Because remember, there's these, there's these sort of six endpoints going out of our region. And we don't want to change anything outside. So if you think about it, it's all sort of forced here. And actually, you shouldn't even have to think. Um, just picking the same color is always sort of the best option, unless you, you're afraid you reduce the number of colors. But there's already. There's only one color here, but the rest of the picture must have more colors. So we still haven't lost any colors. Yes, here's this. Oh, wait, there's only a few more possibilities here. So here we have this. Okay, so this is, um, this, this, let's say this possibility is, uh, let's call this L, let's call this M, join M. Let's call this win. So let's change one of them. So I guess the basic, the way I'm going to sort of enumerate these or go through these cases, let's consider these the same color, but now I'm going to try to change this to another color. Uh, not a so stand in the top right should be M also then, right? Right, right. So this forces us to make this M, and then, um, so this is all M, but here we have L, so this must be the third color, N, say. And here's still M. And now, but since this is N, this is now L. Okay. All right, so here, I guess I could have just done this from the beginning, actually, because the way I'm thinking of it is, um, well, anyways, I think it's sort, of, it's sort of clear that this is more or less forced once I make choices right here, here, and here, right? Okay, so this is, what would I do here? Here, this has to be N. This is still, this, the endpoints going out should be colored the same. So this is M, and this is M, and then this is L, and this is L. So that has to match up with what's happening outside. I guess the only way, place where now I get to sort of try to choose is in here, right? And I guess now I'm forced to pick N by the tricolor. I don't know, so if you like to make a neat set of notes.